enroll your child for the manifested e-learning platform and see their grades grow tremendously. These videos can be downloaded to a laptop for offline viewing or viewed from a smartphone in a cost-friendly format. Hi everyone, I take this pleasure to welcome you once again to our today's mathematics lesson. We will continue practicing on how to multiply whole numbers. Multiplication of whole numbers. Multiplication. Multiplication. In our last lesson, I gave you exercises from your book. And uh, before we proceed with other exercises, I'm going to answer one of the questions. That is question number six. This is a word problem. And first I read it, then we'll work it out together here on the board. Number six reads as follows. In a book, there are 569 pages. Each page has 232 words. How many words are there in the book? So in a book, you are told there are 569 pages. Each page has 232 words. How many words are there in the book? So, um, answer to that question. You are told in a book there are 569 pages. Each page has 232 words. So, one page, one page has 232 words. Therefore, 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 569 pages, 569 pages. In 569 pages, the question is, how many words are there? How many words? If in one book, in one page, there are 232 words, okay? It's like this book here, our book. Assume this is the book we are talking about. So just on page one. On one page, you are told there are 232 words. So if you want to know how many words are in this, the whole of this book, then we will multiply. We will get the product of the number of pages and the number of words. So the pages, the number of words that are there in a book will be equal to, will be equal to uh, 569 times 232 divide by this one okay so we can now multiply we can multiply five uh, 69 by 232 by 232 so as usual we multiply the first number with every digit of the second number to start with, we'll have these two times the number 569. Then we multiply these three. And this three is in the place value of tens. So it will be 30 times 569 followed by these two, which is in the place value of hundreds. So we'll have 200 times 569. 569. So we'll have our working here. 569 times 2. 9 times 2. 8 carry 1. Carry 1. 6 times 2. 13 plus 1. Uh, this is 12 plus 1, which is 13 carry 1. 5 times 2. 10 plus 1. 11. So we come here and write 8, 3, 1 and one one and one then 569 
times 30. 9 times 3, 27, write 7, carry 2. 6 times 3, 18, plus 2, 20, write 0, carry 2. 3 times 5, 15, plus 2, 17, then there is this 0 here. So we come here and write uh, 0, 7, 0, 7, 1. 7, 1. Then the last number here to multiply 569 times 200. 9 times 2, 18. Write 8, carry 1. Uh, 6 times 2 is 12 plus 1, 13. Write 3, carry 1. 5 times 2 is equal to 10 plus 1, 11. There are two zeros there. You come here and then insert zero, 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 eight, three, one, one. Then we add eight plus zero plus zero is equal to eight. Three plus seven plus zero is equal to ten. Right, uh, one, uh, right, uh, zero, carry one. One plus one, two plus eight, ten, right, zero, carry one. Okay. One plus one, two plus nine. Uh, this is one plus one, two plus seven, nine plus three, twelve, right, two, carry one. One plus one plus one is equal to three, then one. So the number of words, the number of words in a, um, a 562 page book will be equal to 132,008. So the answer here is, the answer here is the number of words, you have seen the number of words will be 132,000 and eight words that was the question the question um, required us to calculate the number of words how many words are there in the book so learners that is uh, the exercise one of the exercises i gave you in our last lesson today i want us to move on to uh, do more exercises. I want us to do more exercises from your book. Exercise. More exercise. More exercise. Uh, what is the product? What is the product? of what is the product of 8753 times 245 so answer answer 8753 times 245 is equal to 8753 times times 245 so we come here and multiply five this five times times eighty seven fifty three then we multiply here forty times eighty seven fifty three next is two hundred two hundred times eighty seven fifty three eighty seven fifty three so let's start with uh, the first one, 87.53 times 5. 3 times 5, 15, write 5, carry 1. Uh, then uh, this is 5. 5 times 5, 25, uh, plus 1, 26, write 6, carry 2. 7 times 5, 35, plus 2, 37, Write 7, carry 3. 
then 8 times 5 is 40 plus 3 43 43 so we come here and write 5 this 5 place value of 1 6 place value of 10 then 7 then 3 then 4 and now try and multiply the next which is 8 7 5 3 times 40 3 times 4 12 2 carry 1 5 times 4 20 plus 1 21 write 1 carry 2 carry 2 7 times 4 28 plus 2 30 write 0 carry 3 8 times 4 32 plus 3 uh, 35 35 and there is one zero there so you come here and write come here and write zero this zero then two this two one is one zero is zero five is five then three and lastly we multiply eight seven five three times two hundred 200 3 times 2 6 5 times 2 10 write 0 carry 1 7 times 2 14 plus 1 15 write 5 carry 1 8 times 2 16 plus 1 17 there are two zeros here so we write 0 0 these two zeros then 6 this 6 then 0 this 0 then 5 is 5, then 7 is 7, then 1. So that's how you do it. After multiplying, then we add. We add. You can then add. 5 plus 0 plus 0 is equal to 5. 6 plus 2 plus 0 is equal to 8. 7 plus 1 plus 6 is equal to 14. Write 4. Carry 1 plus 2. 3 plus 0 plus 0 is equal to 4. Then 4 plus 5 plus 5 is equal to 14. Write 4. Carry 1. Uh, plus 3 plus 7, 11. Write 1. Carry 1. Here, 1 plus 1 is equal to 2. So the answer here is 2,144,485. This is the product of 8 1753 and 245 245 that is the product Lana do you understand multiplication let us have another example before I give you an opportunity to exercise on your own we will work together Another example. Let me take another example here. Uh, this is um, uh, 719 times 506. What is the product? The product. The product is what you get when you multiply two numbers. So 719 times 506 is equal to 719 times 506 we multiply first we multiply the top number by every digit of the lower number so we'll have here 6 times 719 is one then 0 0 0 0 times 719 then we'll have 500 times 719 so 719 times 6 9 times 6 is equal to 54 write 4 carry 5 1 times 6 plus 5 is 5 here it's 11 write 1 carry 1 7 times 6 42 plus 1 43 we write here 43 so this number, we insert it here. This times this is 
equal to 4, place value of 1s, then 1, place value of 10s, then 3, place value of 100s, then 4, place value of 1000s. Next one, we don't need to multiply because we know any number multiplied by 0 will be equal to 0. So we write 0, 0, 0, 0. Then next is 7, uh, 19 times 500, times 500. 9 times 5 is equal to 45. Write 5, carry 4. 1 times 5 is 5, plus 4, 9. Then 5 times 7, 35. Write 35, there are two zeros. So we have two zeros here. Then 5, this 5. Then we have 9, 9 is 9, 5 is 5, then 3. So we can now comfortably add. 4 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 is equal to 4. 1 plus 0 plus 0 is equal to 1. 3 plus 0 plus 5 is equal to 8. 4 plus 0 plus 9 is equal to 13, right? 3 carry 1. 1 plus 5 is equal to 6 then 3. So the product of 709 and 506 is 363,814. So learners, that is the product. This is the product. So we will stop there for today so that you can go do exercises on your own now i'll give you work from your book go to page 16 exercise exercise 13 from question 1 to question 10 go and do question 1 to question 10 if you'll have any problem working out any of these questions then below this video you can request me to help you solve any of the problems thank you for attending our today's lesson and god bless you manifested publishers limited is a research and teaching center that specializes in the production of learning materials and private online tuition for primary secondary tertiary and university education Sign up as a new customer at www.manifest.com.